Tap in the search field and we get a list of preset search terms below. I'm going to look for pharmacies on the iPhone and banks and ATMs on my iPad. That quickly displays several results for each search on the map. Tap on a result here in the list and its marker is enlarged on the map and we can then get directions, view other details, add it as a favorite or to a collection. Notice that at the bottom of the pharmacies list, they're broken up by store. So if I usually get prescriptions from Rite Aid, I can view only the nearby Rite Aids here on the map. Searches are performed in the area that's currently displayed on the map. So on the iPhone, if I'm on my way to another town, say Twin Falls, as I move the map over there, a Search Here button appears. Tap to perform the pharmacy search in this area. Tap on the X to exit the search. It's also possible to search for specific locations and landmarks. On the iPad, I'm going to bring up Salt Lake City on the map. Then do a search for In-N-Out Burger. That displays all the In-N-Out Burger locations in this area. Tap on the microphone icon in the search field to dictate a search term. I'll search for museums in Seattle. Museums. That quickly gives me a list of local museums. Or I can tap on the search nearby button for museums to see them all on the map. As searches are performed, they're saved in a recent searches list. Swipe left on each to delete them one by one, or tap the clear button to reset the recent searches list. Finally, we can also search for names that are saved in our contacts list. If I just enter the name Jeff, within the top results is Jeff Alexander, who I have saved as a contact and Amanita Street is his home address, which is why the home icon is displayed here. Search for Mike, and Mike B comes up, who is also saved in my contacts, but I only have his work address saved, so a different icon is displayed here. So the search tool within Maps is pretty powerful. It can quickly find multiple locations for a certain service, or the specific address for a business, or an individual that you have saved as a contact.